Hey, what's going on guys? Joe with OMGRC here. So today, just been looking at a bunch of RC vehicles. Actually, just between the two manufacturers as of right now, Traxxas and Arma. So there's new vehicles on Arma as well as Refresh and, and so on onto the Traxxas stuff. Now, I've been looking at the Typhon and basically this lineup here, Big Rock, the Granite, Saint, the Centon. So those are ones I've been looking at. Those pretty much right there. Now... I did kind of come up with something like I was like, okay, these are 300 bucks. Now, I know as far as most of my what people that you know, you guys that are watching, are in a price or in a age range, basically in my age range as well. You know, you're in your 30s, 40s or so, and it may be some as far as younger, in the 20s or so. And those guys, you know, as far as I don't know what you guys as far as when it comes to buying something like 300 bucks nah, that's out of my you know that's out of my price range or you know like okay you know we're looking at these brushed systems and here's the thing the only thing reason why i don't really i don't really want a brushed system to showcase is because of the fact that i'm already i'm past that point of only going that speed i want something that you know kind of pushes a little bit you know it's pushing faster you gotta use a little bit you know, you're using a little bit more skill to drive it just because of the speeds and everything like that. It's just more fun, right? I'm not a professional RC driver or anything like that. What I'm just saying is, like, I'm comfortable 30 miles an hour is like, eh, whatever. You know, 50 miles an hour is fun zone. So I think that's that's a good speed. I like that zone. It's not too crazy. 70 miles an hour is cool, but I know those those aren't, like, straight out of the box. I think those you got to put a different gear in them. I think these here are going to be ones that are already geared to go that fast. I could be wrong on that one. I haven't really done a lot of research on these as of right now. I've just been looking. I like the style of the black and the red. looks really cool. I could put some other wheels on it, like some maybe GRPs or some other tires that are on there that I haven't used before, and, uh, you know, make it look really sick looking. So I like that. Those are – I like the buggy. looks really good. And I think it would be good for, you know, as far as even just jumping it and what have you. So these are going to be some cars that I kind of want to – I'm not going to bash the crap out of these things. Um, but I do want to jump them, run them, and whatever else. Who knows? So anything's possible at this point. I want to see how durable these vehicles are. You guys uh, – some of you guys have already – I've seen a lot of people loving these things. And I need to get in on that and see – I want my own take on it. And I've driven them before as far as some other ones before – Centen, I think it was this. I don't know which one it was. It was some other Creighton. Nah, I don't know. Yeah, it was a Creighton, uh, but it was the old style. It was an older one, like black and green or something like that. Anyway, that's so. Anyway, I'm looking at these as well. I think as far as these are the new news that are here. As far as Notorious and stuff like that, I don't, really, I don't like the bodies that much. Don't hate me, but it's just me being real. And. Uh, I don't know. I like if I'm gonna choose any of the notorious body colors, I'm gonna go with black. I think the black looks really nice. That one looks cool. That fits my personality. I like my vehicles black. I've had yeah. If they're one color, I paint them black. That's how it's always been. I'm trying to change that, but uh, it's just my favorite color since I was a kid. So that's what it is. Uh, now, when it comes to Traxxas, well. We know there's a lot of stuff that you can do with these vehicles. And so I'm looking for a four-wheel drive Traxxas. That could be the Slash. It could be, you know, an on-road car. The Tech, the Fortech. I don't know about that. That's a little bit... I don't know about that one. Maybe, maybe. I like the Slash a little bit off-road. I can definitely do that one. I can dig it. These here, as far as the Slash, when it comes to the two-wheel drive, make it a dragster, put a different body top on it. I've seen that. It looks sick. Proline definitely came out with some new body tops that are dragsters, and it's got me drooling a little bit. It's got me like, I feel like I'm missing out. So, might be one I might pick up. I might pick up a, a Traxxas Slash, make it a dragster. I think it'd be freaking awesome. So, that's going to be something I potentially could do. Also, I do like these rally cars, but again, they're not high off the ground, and I feel like it's going to maybe limit to me to not having a lot of fun with it. So I don't know about that one yet. But if I make it a dragster, obviously I'm gonna be it's gonna be on road. So we'll see, but I need some versatility. So maybe I pick up a couple cars, I pick up a couple Traxxas, I could pick up a couple Armas and uh, you know go to town that way. So I don't know as far as price range yet. Um, 
since I don't carry these, I'm going to go to a local hobby shop, see if I can work a deal or something like that. I really want a little bit of a deal on it. If I'm going to buy a couple cars, they'll, they'll be pretty good as far as to do it. And, uh, but you know, unless someone can reach out to me and like, Hey, you know, you know, we'll give you a better deal. You know, what are you looking for? Cool. Uh, because it's cost, you know, obviously to keep this channel going, I want to keep new content coming, and that content's expens expensive. And, you know, as of being a dealer, yeah, I can get a little bit of a discount. It's not huge, but it definitely helps, you know, when it comes to these vehicles. So, with that, um, that's what I'm at. Uh, you know, I really don't know what exactly why I want, <laughs> but I want some four wheel drive. I was looking at the tactical unit, thing looks awesome. I want to put some airsoft guns on there. And, uh, you know, be able to blast some stuff and put a camera on it and uh, make it really cool. I don't know. That would be cool to kind of rig something up to have some kind of little guns on there or whatever to shoot. I don't know as far as my skills on that, but I would definitely feel like I could probably come up with something on there. But I don't know yet. It just looks really fun. They have the other vehicles. I know, like, the, the Blazer came out. Eh, I don't know about I, it looks it looks good. I'll be honest. It looks good. They they look good, but this one just looks like more like you can be a little kid, you know, like oh I want to put guns on it. You put your GI Joe guy in there or what? I don't know whatever figure in there. But I know that well it's all you can't. It's not clear, so that's something else you have to modify to get that done. Anyway, that's where I'm at. If that didn't help at all, I don't know, but I'm just trying to figure it out. I like the Desert Racer. There's a lot of RC cars as far as what Traxxas has as well that I haven't uh, ye bought. I've had already the Slash. I've had the Rustler. I've had the – what else have I had? Um, the Stampede. I've had that two-wheel drive. That one's – I didn't like it. But um, this is a two-wheel drive. I didn't care for it. I like the Mustang as well. I don't know. There's a lot of cars, so I mean, you're probably in the. I'm in the same boat as probably most of you guys, where you're like, "Oh, I like that one. I like that one. I like that one." You know, like a kid in a candy shop. So, but maybe you guys can say, "Okay, well, maybe you say, well, we want to see more." Maybe there's a lot of guys that say, "I want to see more Traxxas. I want to see Traxxas on your YouTube channel. I want to see more Arma on your YouTube channel." You know, let me know. You know, like, but don't be that guy that just says, "This sucks." Because I give me a give me. <laughs> What do you think? Do you like either one of these brands? I really don't care as far as if you don't like either one of them. These are the brands that I'm going to pick is one of these two, if not both, and then showcase some of those cars. That's where I'm at with it. I think these cars, these manufacturers are good, and there's a lot of part support for them as well, but there's a lot you can do with them. So I'm not going to, you know, kind of neglect that because it's real. That's reality, right? There's a lot of stuff for these vehicles. More on the Traxxas side, but I, I like the Arma stuff, and I definitely feel that that's a good company as well. Like I said, I want to make sure I broaden the horizon. I don't want it to be one of these things where I'm stuck in a box of just what I sell. And if I don't sell it, then you guys kind of – I feel – I me personally, I get left out. It's like I want, to, I want to enjoy those other vehicles as well. Yeah, I don't sell them, but I want to experience those as well. And I don't want to be like that where it's like, well, I can't, I can't showcase these because I don't sell them. No, I'm not doing that. I'm not limiting myself just to what I sell on the website. That's not fair to me or I think to you guys as as far as to, you know, grow this YouTube channel anyhow. That's where I'm at with it. You guys chime in. Let me know what you think. It is late here. It's almost 12 o'clock Eastern Standard Time in Florida. But I needed to get, not really needed to get a video out, but I want to get this off my chest as far as to what where I'm at with it. I'm, I'm trying to sell off a lot of RC vehicles and I want to get a bunch of new ones. So that's where I'm at with it. So I appreciate you guys tuning in. Also, if you are new here, appreciate you guys subscribing and, uh, you know, checking out the omgrc.com website where we got some of the goodness as well. So there's lots of brands that we carry, but I just want some other brands that I don't carry. You know how it is when you don't have something, you want it, right? It's just, that's the mentality sometimes. So these are ones I don't carry, and I want some of those. So that's where it, it's at right now. Anyway, till next time, you guys take care. Thank you for watching.